This is again Luis DeRoso and the Summit on Puerto Rican Affairs here in Kissimmee, Florida, a statewide initiative. Today we have a special guest from Washington, D.C., appointed by the President of the United States, William A. Ramos, who is the Director for Intergovernmental Affairs for the Department of Commerce. And we thank you for your effort. We thank you for your support. We thank you for your initiative. We believe that education is important. We believe that business development is important, as well as representation. Uh, what Maybe you can just enlighten us a little more, give us some information, rather, regarding the export and import initiative of the president. Well, Luis, uh, primeramente, muchas gracias. Thank you for inviting me to the summit. Uh, it's very important for the administration to continue doing the outreach with communities across the United States, including the Puerto Rican business community. Uh, the Department of Commerce is the business department of the United States, and one of the initiatives that we're spearheading for President Obama is the National Export Initiative, uh, where the president wants to double our exports across uh, uh, the country throughout the world and increase uh, through exports uh, several million jobs across the United States, new jobs, new high paying jobs that for an average uh, of export jobs, 15% more than, than a regular job here in the United States. And through the National Export Initiative, we're reaching out to communities across the United States to be part of that uh, uh, initiative and exports. Now, interestingly, only 1% of U.S. business export outside of this country. Okay. So if you produce, you're, only 1% is, is exporting. And of that 1%, 58% are only exporting to either Canada or Mexico. And when 95% of the world's consumers live outside of the United States borders, it's important for us to go where the customers are. And that's why it's important for the Puerto Rican community and Puerto Rican businesses to start looking outside of the United States to increase uh, their, their businesses, increase their exports, and create jobs here for Puerto Ricans and all Americans. Good, I think, I think you're absolutely right. And and I think one of the issues that the Puerto Rican Chamber of Commerce support is the fact that we need to start looking at ways to expand into other markets, not just our local uh, consumers, but start looking at other markets, Canada, Israel, England, uh, Africa, you know, the Middle East, Latin America, the Caribbean, as a means to uh, increase business opportunity. And that is very, very, very crucial for the development of any small business. And small business people are the ones that are creating the jobs. They're the ones that are making things happen in this country, which is why we're focusing on today on education, uh, business development, and of course representation. We believe in the power of the vote. That is correct, Lewis. And, and uh, for the last 14 months, we have seen an increase, steady increase of jobs in the United States. We created 2.1 million jobs across the country, and most of those jobs are created by small and medium-sized businesses, businesses that are 500 employees or less. And those are the type of businesses that are growing this economy back uh, uh, from from the uh, near recession that we had. Good. Thank you, and thank you for your support, and thank, and thank the president on behalf of the Puerto Rican community. Thank you so much. Please.